everyone, I'm Devin Coombs, and today I will be going over question two of CSUN's Gateway Lab practice for managerial accounting. So the question reads, an example of qualitative data is A, product cost, B, customer satisfaction, C, net income, D, inventory cost, or E, net worth. So we discover these concepts a lot in managerial accounting and for the rest of your studies in college, but the difference between qualitative data and quantitative data. We also cover this in statistics. But quantitative data is information that we can directly measure. So cost is a very good example of quantitative data or uh, anything that is just exactly measurable, like my height is another example. Uh, qualitative data is much more vague uh, but we still try to measure it. So a good example of qualitative data is how much you like something or uh, how good something tastes or your opinion on a movie. Um, the w only example that pops out here is customer satisfaction, which is a B. So B is the answer. But let's go through everything. So A, product cost, that would be quantitative data because we can quantify it because there is an exact amount we can say that shirt over there costs five dollars or ten dollars um, for c net income that's quantitative and exact as well we can say that company had a million dollars of net income same thing with inventory cost it's exact if there's no subjective line there the inventory cost a certain amount of money and that's what you paid for it as well as net worth individuals are worth an exact amount of money uh, but customer satisfaction that's more vague you can say we satisfy most customers. Our customers have a great experience. But what does that necessarily mean? Uh, we can't exactly measure that. We can't say, oh, customers have a 10 satisfaction. It, it doesn't really work that way uh, because cut customer satisfaction is subjective. So when looking at qualitative and quantitative data and asking yourself, what's the difference? You really have to look at for information that isn't exactly definable from an objective standpoint. We're looking at more subjective information. I hope that helps. If you have any other questions regarding this, feel free to contact me or comment below. Have a great day.